Hi, it's Leighton from Paramount Properties and welcome to our market update where you can find out what we are seeing in the property market right now. Today we are talking about what we have seen since the initial stamp duty holiday ended on the 30th of June, what the impact has been on the property market since then and what we expect to see going into the final four months of 2021. Through July and August we definitely saw a decline in the number of new buyers registering and the actual number of viewings taking place. But July and August are traditionally quieter months when it comes to buying and selling, so it doesn't necessarily mean that the property market has fallen off a cliff. It does feel like less people have been going abroad this year and a lot of our buyers have been taking shorter breaks in the UK. Here at Paramount we have actually seen a 50% uplift in the number of agreed sales in August compared to the same month last year. You may see articles talking about the market plummeting and the huge decline in transactions in July this year, but what we have to consider is that after the stamp duty holiday was announced, transaction levels significantly boosted from 2020 with buyers racing against the clock to save themselves a substantial amount of money. As we go into September, we will really be able to start gauging what is happening in the property market. But of course, we won't know the full impact of the stamp duty holiday until after the second stamp duty holiday ends, which is the 30th of September. Looking at the figures, there is less activity in terms of people buying, but we've also seen a decrease in the number of properties available. We may not be able to achieve some of the inflated prices that were hit through March, April and May, as people will be paying an extra £15,000 in stamp duty compared to what they would have paid a few months ago. Having said that, we are finding the demand is still outweighing the supply. Based on speaking to people every day, there is a great deal of optimism amongst buyers, continued demand for larger properties and those that have outside space. We also have a good number of sellers already preparing to launch their property through September, so I expect the market will stay strong over the next few months. If you have any questions about buying or selling a property or are looking for a more specific market update based on your position or your property, then please just drop me a message to say hello and I'd be happy to discuss with you.